Oh boy. What hell? Things like some kind of shit. Probably one. And into war. Too freaking cla- This hole in my chest ache. Someone must have sl It says, I'm a friend. Trust. Trust is essential. I still can't believe that that animation essentially locks you in place. That's just... <laughs> hey, it disappeared. What kind of game is Am playing this time? It literally disappeared. How is this possible? There's a door. I've never seen it. All the cap. My name's printed on the front of this book. My name. It was me. I was AM all along. Well, not really. Where's the crew? I'm all alone here. I s find it sort of interesting that he'd say that when he knows that he is one of the last five people alive in the world. Yeah. It's really weird. I mean... Whatever. My stomach's growling. And we don't care here, so you just move it. You used to door. Where's the crew? I'm all alone here. There's something hard under the. There's some. What good will that. I don't know what to do. That good lord, man. <laughs> <laughs> Being absolutely obtuse. It's heavy. Heavier than it ought to be. The bullet in this gun is huge. Damn thing could bring down an elephant. Oh, it's a howdah pistol. There you go. Good times. My stomach's growling. We know, guys. The good lord gave up already. Someone sure trashed this place. Must have been one hell of a fight. This junk looks like it was knocked over in the fight. There's blood here and God knows what else. Vomit stains. Near the punch bowl. It stinks in here. Hmm. Yeah, I haven't really noticed it, but uh, on the ship, did you at any point That's come across an away. engine? Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. And I suppose I meant to grab the bread and eat it. Yep. Don't mind if I do. I'm no longer hungry, but I still feel empty. What's wrong with me? An old cookbook. It's empty, but the label says poison, fatal if swallowed. Damn thing looks ready to fall. An old cook. Here's a recipe for the milk of human kindness. Take the willingness to forgive and the will to be forceful. Mix the blood of innocence and the anger of the wronged. What kind of crap is this? I just really love his friendly demeanor and general, you know, 
positive outlook. Right. He's a great one. Is the dead? It smells like <laughs> piss. Uh, Rotting meat. Doodle 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 doodle. My God, I'm killing those poor creatures in the cages. I've got the key. Mm. I wonder, can you push the lever multiple times? I suppose it's possible, but uh, it wouldn't be very nice, now would it? Well, since we don't know if it is possible, it would be for the sake of science if we do it. <laughs> science! Good point, good point. I've washed my hands of the past. He's happy again. He's got his yeah. horrible... I just love that wonderful smiling face. God. He's got ha ha ha! He is Take so this, happy assholes! To... He's so happy to have clean hands. Metal in the fork. Short circuited the engine wiring. I hope you figured out that this was what you were supposed to do. Otherwise, no good ending for you. Huh. Interesting. Big gray bags of gas. I must be inside an airship. <laughs> This leads to me. Ah, when I pick a walk no to the tail, why now. not just do it? Damage put me on an iron zeppelin. But why? Why would he give me a chance to escape? Hmm, well, wait a minute, what's that? Oh, it's my heart! My heart's all wired up like some kind of weird guidance system. Yeah, apparently you're Damn supposed to get that. I'm not gonna like where it's taking me. I have no idea why, but at least you should. It's my heart. I sort of would prefer that to be attached to my body. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Well, Let's see here. Are, are we supposed to cut the gas bags then or not? Uh, yes. You do need to cut the gas bags in order to, uh,. Lower the altitude. Uh, wow, that animation right there. So that you can actually get to that bar. That is some animation. Only there's no good heart of mine doesn't beat anymore. That's fine, isn't it? There we go. Rope. Let's see. Can you swallow the heart? Gas is rushing out. <laughs> uh, that might be what we're supposed to do later on. Something feels different. We landed, but where? Some roadside honky tonk. With well, my name on it. This could be a problem. The According to the guy that said to pretty much cut three of the airbags. So I guess probably even this thing isn't yeah. really all that trustworthy. Yeah, it probably just means to do four the quicker. Honestly, I like these tires though. Or maybe it's the one gas bag with the stitches counted as one. Yeah, there you go. I guess, but whoever was a uh, wrote the walkthrough worded it pretty weird. Dark and grubby, but somehow familiar.
He took my baby away, then just about killed her. That stupid truck driver. He took my baby away. Okay, and according to the guide, you're just supposed to explore the place, and you should find a shovel somewhere. Insane asylum. Why not? It was my fault, wasn't it? You don't ever take me dancing. That's what Glennis said the night we fought. Oh God, why'd I have to hit her? I'd rather kill myself than hurt my poor Glennis. Sniff, sniff. All right, let's see. Do we have anything to drink? Ah, oh, there we go. Got myself a drink. Now then, let's see. Ah, oh, back door. Well, Gorister, you've seen better days. So has the big machine, for that matter. Huh. Hello. Things just got real trippy. What are you? I'm man's best friend. One of them, at least. No. What are you, really? Let me answer with a riddle. Today I saw a child. Now what do you suppose that means? Your am. Playing with my mind again. No, but I do have an in with the big machine. He and I are like brothers. Why can't you give me a straight answer? Like so many others down here, I'm cursed to speak in riddles. We all have our curses to bear. Hey, Gorister. Yeah? What's my curse? After 109 years in the belly of the beast, I think you'd have a gut instinct by now. Look, I'm getting tired of your smart mouth. Come, come, Forrester. Forgive and forget. Where do you come from? I'm realizing that we've all been silent for quite a long time. Yeah, period. well, you know. Tension is being worked so up here. Yeah. There you the go. Mountains. Sometimes you just gotta let the game speak for itself, I guess. Yep. That desert doesn't well, to be worse than the other perfectly world. fair, at least for me, no that's course. pretty much the norm. my words, Gorister. Mm. You'd never make it alone out there. And don't expect me to be a good doggy at tag along. What do you want? I have a craving. A craving for something scrumptious. A human heart, perhaps. Yours. Oh, dear. Hmm. Mm. Decisions, decisions. Mm. Well, well, the guy does say that you're supposed to give it to him. And we aren't using it anymore. Fine. Ah, I think I'll save this delicacy for later. You want to get across the mountains? Go to the restroom and flush three times. And that... <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't a joke, Goris. Why are you smiling like that? The smuggest jackal. <laughs> He's like, hey, that's a good joke. Hey, flush three times. <laughs> I never flush. That's it. Yeah, I just fed my heart to a dog. <laughs> I must be completely insane. I, I agree with the assertion that his happy face is probably more horrifying than anything else we've seen in the game so far. Yeah. Harry looks like he's on another one of his drinking binges. Harry looks like... Well, right, Harry, let's have a chat, you and I. So, yeah. Harry, how did you get here? You know, it's a big place, the desert. Got lost in it myself. It doesn't really answer the question. I, you know. Yeah, that's part of my drink. drink. Harry, how did you want get some rye? The of course you do. Forester. We came on the Zeppelin. Let me pour you a drink. 
What do you know about the Zeppelin? You'll have to talk to Edna. She knows all about the Zeppelin. That's why we did it, you know. What did you do? You know, Gorister. You've been to the dining room. What happened in the dining room? Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. What? So just where is my dear mother-in-law? Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. Fine, okay. I'll give you another drink. Let Jeez. Pour you a drink. What happened in the dining room? I shouldn't have let her force me into it. I'm not a murderer. Who did you kill? Sorry, you but if you actually killed someone, room, pretty much are. Mostly, did you? Or haven't you had to take a leak yet? And just where is my dear mother-in-law? I don't know. Good God, I, I can't stand the sight of her anymore. Can you imagine being kept alive for 109 years just to hear her carping? Whose heart was impaled on the Zeppelin spike? Why, yours, of course. How'd you think we got here? What's this about a thunderstorm? You know, it's a big place, the desert. Got lost in it myself. Let me pour you a drink. What do you know about the desert? Looks like there's a thunderstorm on it the horizon. It is kind of weird how they take it so normally that a heart was impaled on the spike on the front of the Zeppelin. Yeah, it is weird, isn't it? I mean, seriously. Oh, it was just your heart that we impaled on the Zeppelin. Why are you asking? Yeah, yeah no Oh, idea. right. My heart. Jeez. Oh, silly me. Of course. There's something shiny yeah. inside there. According the to the guide in the bathroom, I think it was specifically the urinal, there's supposed to be a magnifying glass there. Yep. Magnifying glass. And you're supposed to take that back to the Zeppelin, go back to the dining room, and use the magnifying glass to uh, check the wreckage more closely. Graffiti. A magnifying glass next to a urinal? There's some kind of joke in there. Ha! <laughs> yes there is. Yes there is. Let's see if we can find the door. There's the front one. Do -do 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 -do. Whoops. This is where I'm going. Here's some hair that was pulled out during the fight. It's the same color as mine. And here's some that matches Harry's. Now I understand what happened here. And that makes him so happy. Sherlock Holmes, eat your heart out. Why is well, he actually, so Holmes ate Goris's heart out, and that's the whole thing. There you go. There you go. Time to confront our murderer. I was the one you killed, wasn't I, you bastard? I'm sorry, Gorister. Edna poisoned the punch, and after you drank it, I wrestled you to the ground. When the poison took effect, I cut you open. Why did you kill me? It's too complicated for me to explain. You'll have to ask Edna. Let me pour you a drink. Talk to you later. Ever Why did you kill me? Well, we needed somebody's heart, and Edna didn't want to give up hers. <laughs> a toilet stall. To be honest, I suspected a long time ago that she doesn't have one, but... None of this makes sense. None of this make is sense. Really, guys? Really? <sighs> Fine. One, a two, 
How many flushes does it take to get to? I'm not sure how to finish that stage. Yeah, I was about to say. A meat locker? How'd I get... Bodies on meat hooks. Damn, you bastard. You what got there by flushing the toilet three times. Glennis, what has Am done to you, honey? Okay, and according to the That's guy, Edna. you're supposed to talk to Edna. Oh, this is too good. And to at be one true. point, she pretty much goes on that you have to help her. <laughs> I really, yeah, yes, her that she can I do yes, that. And I just really have to say, I, I, I just love that comment. My mother-in-law, her body hung on a meat spike. It's too good to be true. <laughs> oh my god, what have I done? That's Edna. No, this is too good to be true. <laughs> it looks like now, I see, can't escape. If there is now. any point at which the, the happy face back. would have been appropriate. Escape from me, Gorster. We're family after all. You were always telling Glennis how much you hated me. Forrester, I was just concerned about my baby. Glynis was so lonely with you always being out on the road. I know you were doing the best you could. Edna, you bitch. I know all about your Well, actually, and on 0286, you are supposed to do that, but just not yet. I've always been harsh on you, I admit. But we're the last people on Earth. Let's help each other now. Why should I trust my own murderer? Alliances change, Gorst. Something's gone wrong. Am's two Conrads don't listen to me anymore. I need you. And you need me. It's that simple. Help her. Yeah, okay. You truck driving son of a bitch! This is for me and my baby! Let me go. I've got you now, Forrester. And if you think you'll ever escape me, you've got some new thinking to do. Uh-oh. Please, I'll do anything you ask. I don't know what's come over me, Forrester. Can you ever forgive me? I've been hanging here for so long, I'm not thinking straight. A sip of that milk grew in my head. Haha, <laughs> no, I don't trust you. Forrester, let me down or I'll scratch your eyes out, you worthless excuse for a man! Edna, you dropped a key. Hand me back that key and let me down! I'm your only hope of getting out of here! Sorry, Edna, but I don't trust you as far as I can spit. Let me prove my good intentions. I'll let you go. Now give me the key. Sure. I'm tired, <laughs> son of a bitch! I'll rip your spleen out! I'm taking you with me, Edna. And he wasn't kidding either. <laughs> what the hell? Dead look alive, you're coming with me. Whoop. What? <laughs> well, this certainly took a weird turn. Glimpse. I mean, weird even for this mm. game, of course. Look at the beef. beef. Can you talk to Edna? Great A quality too. Ham's never given us some. Last time I checked, if you're trying to talk to her, she'll just keep here. screaming that she's going to rip your spleen out, and that's about it. Howdy, kiddo. But I don't know. Now that Edna's in there, could that? Possibly be construed as some sort of commentary oh, involving the objectification of women. Escape from here. Such information. Probably. It could if you wanted it to, but I don't think we should go there. I'll offer you a trade. Can you swallow Etna? For eggs. Or give it to the dog? Uh, her to the dog? I've got nothing more to say to you. Now we could just give the jackal Edna's heart, but that would be a mean thing. That's not what we're going to do. 
Weren't we supposed to give Glynis the elixir, or is that not yet? Not yet. Stop spoiling! Whoa. Okay. Sorry. So many dials and controls. Push all the buttons. Oh, hey, look. Edna wrote this log book. Never not push buttons. When Am took us down here before the war, I didn't know anyone could hate Forrester more than me. But Am did. He hated all of us. If I can just deliver Forrester's soul on a platter, I can make amends for every minute of Linus's life I took from her. I never meant to drive her crazy. I'll be damned. Edna's claimed responsibility for Glennis. Maybe it wasn't my fault after all. I thought I could do He looks a bit like Dolph Lundgren like that, doesn't he? A little bit, yes. A little bit. Bring myself to cut out a severely brain damaged Dolph Lundgren. There you go. That's 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 more like it. Well then and horribly malnourished. We don't finish the job. Am will feed me alive to the machine just like an animal. Well, there you go. Toilet stall. Ham's never given us pro Glennis. She can't talk. All she can do is do my god, what have I done? Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. This fluid should revive you, honey. Glennis, all these years and I thought I was the one who was responsible for your suffering. Let me help you now. She's gone. At least I finally made amends with her. I'm taking her body out of this freezer. So he has a tied up woman screaming and shouting and cursing his bones on his left shoulder. And his dead wife on his other shoulder. Huh. It sounds like the premise to a really, really, really bad joke. Or a really, really, really bad sitcom. There we go. Yep. Actually, let's go right back in there. Because here's something that you probably wouldn't think of doing while you were playing this game. The organs are still inside. Reminds me of when Am ripped that hole open in Benny's chest. Of course, Am sewed him back up again before he bled to death. That bastard's never gonna let us die. He said with a giant smile. <laughs> yeah, serious. He's never gonna let us die. Ha ha ha! Oh dear. One heart looks like another. Mmm, beef heart. Them's good Edens. It wouldn't be an adventure game without an extremely convoluted thing that you would never ever think to do. Right then. So... Want some of this? I'm not giving this away. If I'm gonna... I'm not giving this away. Oh come on, you can do it. Uh, you are supposed to give him a heart, just not that one, I believe. Ah, this is Edna's heart. A bitter organ, but worth its weight in gold to me. I give you your heart back. Hmm. I read Edna's logbook, and everything's much clearer. Now what? You must make amends and bury the past, Gorester. I've got nothing more to say to you. You can't take your garbage with you. 
There's the but heart. But what if I is... want to? Be careful where you use that, Gorister. I like to know where all the bodies are buried. Oh, you. I just like that it used the shovel with the ground. Where else would you dig? <laughs> yeah, seriously. Isn't it a bit premature to be dig? Shut up. Alright, let's push what my... good will that do? No. <laughs> I was thinking of just pushing her body in there. Are you filling it up with trash? You were, weren't you? You were premature to be grabbing that shit out of the fucking trash can. Well, apparently he's still a jerk. Jesus. That is not very respectful of the so dead. How do I get out of here? Not at all. Especially not your dead wife. If you can harness its power. I've made amends and buried the past. An excellent job, Gorister. But the thunderstorm is upon us. You'd better hurry if you want to recharge your old ticker's battery. I've got nothing more to say to you. Yeah, Harry, you might want to get back on Zeppelin, cause shit is about to get real. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, 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 what do we have here? Okay. Nice. I'll be damned. The engine's starting up again. That is a bit. Uh, that is a bit mean, but well, whatever works. Hell yeah. Besides, you can't say she didn't exactly deserve it. The airbags are inflating. She did kind of conspire to cut his heart out, so. Among the whole, just generally being a terrible harpy thing. It's locked. Oh come on. Why did you lock it again? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Gorister. You're so stupid. It's only polite. Right, so let's have a look around here. There's a lot of meat. Got all kinds of shit over here. Power light is lit. So, does anyone, anyone know how to fly a Zeppelin? I just pull this thing, I think. Yeah, but over the top horribleness is kind of the point of this game, Gomez, so it doesn't really surprise me either. We're taking off! But it's not over yet! Of course not. The absolute most important thing is left. I think I know where this is going. Thunder or power not. activates! Hmm. What? <laughs> well. Here, here's a new burden for you while I attempt to resolve this miscalculation. Who among you what shall the go hell? next? Wait, so what was the point of the elixir then? Was it just a complete red herring? Well, we fed it to to base... Apparently, instead of actually bringing her back to life, it let her actually die permanently. Okay. Which was pretty much the best possible gift in a world where Am is under control, because, you know, he's a dick. Right. 
yeah. And as the background of the portrait turned white, that means that was the best ending for Gorista. Awesome. Hooray! Right, so who's up next? The main character from Clock Tower 2, Blanca, Dr. Mengele, or Random Yuppie Guy? <laughs> Play as the Scissor Man. Right. Blank it is. 